came to the situation right up here. I'm just kidding you, sir. Oh, this is going to be fun. No, I'm sure you are manly. Now, we're going to have some fun. You see, I love to do this final thing. And uh, this is my final routine. I used to uh, do escapes as well. I did everything. My grandpa said, you learn stuff quick. You're like one of those idiot savants. But he had an accent, so the savant was silent. And so one thing that I always loved to do was escapes, like Harry Houdini. Have you heard of Harry Houdini, sir? Sure. Sure. Yeah, most people have. Harry Houdini was famous for his escape, escapes. Oh, are you OK? <laughs> that concerns me. No, it's very dangerous. Did you know you can catch the flu just by licking a public toilet seat. Yes. I learned that three times the hard way. Now, yeah, I got it. Thank you. Uh, but we are about to do an escape up here. What is your best time? That feels nice. That is, that is nice. I would wear that. Yeah. Now, what is your best time at getting out of a straight jacket, sir? Uh, two minutes. Two. Seriously? You never had anyone with an answer. <laughs> Professional? That is really good. I did a lot of time. You did a lot of time. Great. Well, this is going to make it interesting because we're going to try to do this in less than one minute, okay? I am going to try to get out of a straitjacket less than one minute just to keep it fair so they're not manipulating anything in the back. We have the countdown right here on the stereo. I'm going to put the microphone over here so we're able to pick it up. So we have the countdown. We have you, sir. Now we just need the straitjacket of doom. <laughs> and there he no, stop. Okay, you guys got to get into this, and you need to smile. We talked about this back in the cabin. Go. <laughs> I guess we're doing it again. <laughs> All right. Ladies and gentlemen, we have you. We have the countdown. We have you that stood up twice. I've never had anybody on a show actually do that. And we have the straitjacket of doom. <laughs> now, if you're not smiling, go in the back. We're going to keep doing it. Now, in now this is perfect, because this is a real straight jacket. This is a real straight jacket. You'll notice the buckles and the straps. Let me count them off. We have one, two, three, four, five buckles on the back. Or for my Spanish friends, uno, dos, tres, and cuatro. <laughs> not allowed to say cinco on a ship anymore. Now it's, told him I was not that good. You just have to put me in, it's simple enough. You'll put the strap through the buckle. That's all you have to do. I'm supposed to pick the hot girl. Okay, thanks for the tip there. Yes, I'm gonna listen to you. Now, I put my arms in and you start at the top. Okay, just start. What do you do for a living, sir? You're a builder, okay. Like Bob. Okay. Can he fix it? Oh, that is really tight, sir. All right, work your way down and uh, you're here with your family? That's your, that's your son that you were trying to get to run to the back of the room by himself? That's cool. You know, I really do have an 11-year-old daughter, and I used to take her with me everywhere. And I took her to the post office one time, left her in the car while I ran into the post office. But you have to understand, our post office is extremely small in my hometown, so I could see her. But my wife found out, was really mad. She said, don't you ever leave her sitting in the car like that. So from then on, every time I went to the post office, I'd have to get her out, put her in the trunk, go in. <laughs> All the way down the back, very good. Now you'll notice there's a strap on this arm, there's a buckle on this arm. The two go together. When I cross my arms, you grab that, comes around to the other side. Okay. <laughs> you don't have to pull on it so hard. We have an important one coming up. <laughs> uh, well, not coming up necessarily. It's all right. All the way. Okay, there you go. That is very tight, I have to tell you. Okay. Now one more strap. We can do this, all right? We're working together. We're going to do this in a manly way. I'm going to swing it back. Come on, you're the one that wore the shirt. All right. I told you I wanted to wear that this morning, but no, you had to get it out. Now I go ahead and I just swing it like that and you just grab, okay? And it's more of a backwards motion, not so much an upwards motion. So you got that? Here we go. Yep, Ralph's paying attention now, aren't you, sir? Here we go. Swinging that. That's when you grab it here. We're almost to San Juan. <laughs> Today, sir. Today. Trust me, they will not question your masculinity anymore. Now, I just go ahead and just grab, okay, there you go. You got it, pumpkin, look at that. Now, just go ahead and put it right through that buckle there. Okay. Whoa, that's, hell no. Okay, all right, that is uncomfortably bad. Jazz, I need you, man. 
<laughs> Look at how tight he did this. Do something, man. Do something. Do something. It's extremely tight. No, my eyes are water. And <laughs> let's hear it for Jazz, and let's hear it for my amazing assistant. You go back to your seat. Thank you there, David Hasselhoff. <sighs> oh, my God. We forgot to start the countdown. <sighs> I can taste pennies. Uh, all right, I'll start it. Here we go. Here we go. You're about to see the 60-second straight jacket. My eyes are really watering. You're about to see the 60-second straight jacket escape. Now, when Harry Houdini would do this, he would hide behind a giant curtain so you couldn't learn the secrets of the straight jacket. But I want you to learn from my experiences. So watch closely. Don't forget to come out and see me right down here, deck four, in the central there. And uh, by the way, ladies, please don't 60, rush the stage. 59, here we go. 58, 57, 56, 53, 54, 53, okay. 52, This is the easy part. Put your arms over your head. 49. Hard part is getting that strap around those buckles in the back. I had lots of practice though as a kid. 44, 43, 42, 41. Can you try to get those loose? 38, 37, 36, 35. None of you seem impressed by that. Okay, what is it? 32, 31, 30, 31 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20. Ladies and gentlemen, Christopher James. Keep it going for your comedy magician, Christopher James. Radio. 